Welcome to Maui, Kimba. Welcome to Maui. For the Huskers, for the Huskies rather, and the Shockers. Only three made baskets. And the first five plus. There's the first for Kimball Walker. Shockers run again. Murray fouled by Walker. That's two on Kimball Walker at the 14-14 mark of the first half. Out of the timeout. Kimball Walker will be back on the floor for the last offensive possession for the Huskies with 25.5 left. 42 versus Vermont, but because of foul trouble in the first half, only two points on the bench. Williams, it's one of two, two-point edge. Here is Kimball Walker. Walker stops, gives it up. Bank home three. UConn goes to halftime with the lead. And a chance to extend. Walker in transition, blocked by Ellen. 42 versus Vermont. That is a UConn career high for Kimball Walker. His lifetime career high was 88 in a blacktop game in his native Bronx. Hill Carter, New York, the task of guarding Kimball Walker. Seven to shoot. Walker finds his way to the hoop for three. Shot just calm down. You're okay. You still have an all Big East guy in Kimball Walker. Blocking foul. That could have been a charge. Close to number four on Walker. A big break goes in the favor of UConn and Kimball Walker. Walker has played only 11 minutes in this basketball game after 42 versus Vermont. It's not an upset. And this game's far from over, but I read the headlines this morning. Vanderbilt upsets North Carolina. No, that, that was not an upset. The Walker miss. Walker gets a steal here. Kimball Walker to the free throw line. The, the jet power that this kid brings. So Greg Marshall was actually playing. Well, make no mistake about it, Kimball Walker is the type of player. Walker with 10 to shoot. Refuses the screen, takes it to the hoop, and draws the foul. And at the EA Sports Maui Invitational. Gonzaga was really hurt by San Diego State on the offensive glass in their loss. A, a high quality win. will happen again. And they will go through your chin to the rim as well as anyone. Neither which it's taking Marshall because their last offensive possession, nothing happened. Walker answers with two. Good as he at getting to the power position in traffic. Didn't get in a hurry. I mean, he can't jump higher than me. But he really hurt every single time and allows him to have some power while he goes up. 17 points on 7 of 8 from the line, despite Walker running off the baseline screens. The junior from the Bronx. Oriaki's bumped. Count the bucket. Count the basket, and Oriaki has a chance. Yeah. You have to build a wall against this guy at all times. That is not a good wall. Swatted away by Blair. Kimball Walker. Wichita State was turning to go back the other way. over by Blair. Hammered that ball, kept his body off of Kimball Walker. Build a wall against Walker again. He should see three sets of eyes, and they're not doing it. He has too much freedom for a kid this good with this determination. He's a difference maker if you don't shut him down. 19 minutes, Kimball. Make it 21 now. And 11 of those points from the free throw line. A so chance to advance on. They're an older team. Can they close it out? On November 22nd, thoughts of March. Oh, Kimball Walker. The huge heart. Give him 25. Twenty-one minutes of play, twenty-five points from Kimball Walker, and now the steal. Walker to the line again. Tim Calhoun wanted an intentional. I think it's a hard Walker has done, and he's done it on both ends of the floor. The star in college basketball of the early season, Kimball Walker, forty-two versus Vermont. Carter, I watched this young man at the LeBron James Skills Academy this summer. 
And I thought, if nothing else, he really, really competed for Hatch. And that stick back, the three-point play. Wichita State back up by one. You know, make someone else beat you right now if you're Wichita State. Get the ball out of Kimba Walker's hands. They don't do it. They absolutely are going to let this guy beat them if they don't. But Jim Calhoun, you like it when 15 has the ball. I'll tell you that much. 29 points in 22 minutes. Wow. Make it 31. Connecticut survived Wichita State yesterday to earn the day with Michigan State. And uh, aside from Oriaki, I'm not sure anybody's over 200 pounds. Great anticipation by Walker, and he'll go in all alone. And Walker, who played only five minutes in the first half after he picked up two fouls. It was, it was the case in the national semifinal in 2004 with Emeka Okafor. It worked out pretty well. What a big fella. Walker on the counterattack, goaltending. Both Kane and they do space well. This young Connecticut team with three freshmen on the court. Shot clock at four and oh, walk by people. It, it, it helps his pace is what Tom thinks. Taking his time. Now. Yeah. Not to shoot from mid-range there and it got blocked. Look at this Walker game. exploding Woo! to the bucket. Green but missed the layup. Walker trying to give Connecticut the lead again. He's fouled. And so Campbell Walker with 12 points. Is at the free throw line. Ties at 28, three minutes to go in the half. You mentioned the lack of punch inside for Michigan State, fellas, and they are a little short-handed up front. Derek Nix, sophomore center, 6'9", 270, did not make the trip. Stayed back home in his time. Connecticut wants the final shot of the half. Down by three, they led for much of the half. They need a shot. They get it from Napier. A three at the buzzer to Woo. tie it up. Look what I got. Walker stuck. What a bailout. Great presence there. Defender on his right as well. Foul called. It's I think Thornton is trying to make the case that it was Walker that created the contact. That's just smart basketball by Kevin. Calhoun, more animated boys, don't you think, today? Than yesterday? Yeah. Point at halftime as we were talking off the air. Connecticut's the 10th best team in the Big East, which is their preseason pick by the coaches. <laughs> That's quite a lead. There are nine Big East teams. Where did it come to him? Didn't force the issue. Ended up with 12 at the half, I believe, and solid. Well, when it's there, he takes it especially in transition when it's not he's worked off the ball he's worked with the ball right against Wichita State today five for five this his efficiency has gone 15 for green nice Walker Walker told Giffy to send it back out Walker knows the situation five to shoot has to shoot it and oh. makes it Summers oh, walk. Oh, Giffy did travel and got away with it, and then Walker short on the layup, but Nick could tie it for the underdog Huskies with under seven minutes to go. Walker Woo. spin into the lane. Tate is right there for the rebound, but they're not finishing it off by grabbing the ball. One minute to go. Walker, does he have it left in the tank? Another tough shot. Woo. He made it. Woo. Wow, reaching back into his tricks. 30 again for Walker. The championship game of the 27th EA Sports Maui Invitational from the Lahaina Civic Center, which is jam-packed. Connecticut and Kentucky ready to go, and UConn in the blue won the tip as it was controlled by Charles Oquandu. Uh, Sean McDonough and Jay Billis. Kentucky go! Bit of it. UConn took down the number two team in the country, Michigan State, last night in the semifinals to earn the date with Kentucky. The number nine team in the country. Here's Kemba Walker with three straight games of 30 points or more, and he picks up right where he's left off. How about the pace? To he's had three double-doubles in his first four college games, and at the <laughs> other end, Oriaki off the setup from Kemba Walker. Just that little one dribble to get into the lane, collapsed that defense and made that shot for Lamb. Boy, Walker found himself alone, and that's a three out of the corner for Kemba Walker. Active the other way. No relation. 
Walker. That's his game. He is. This one's done. These two on the sideline. Uh, we can relate to them. <laughs> nice. Pretty. Step and go. You got away with it pretty much in high school. Neither one of them are, are in my judgment, true point guards. Wow. 20 Temple take on the California Golden Bears. Well, I hope you enjoy your peanuts and crackers. Uh, yeah, the red eye out of here in uh, a couple of hours from now. And knowing you, you will not moan about it. Nope, very happy to be heading to 13 to 2 run for UConn. Go inside to Oriaki. 15 seconds on the shot clock. Walker with Knight right on him. Buries a three. Woo! Timeout, Kentucky. 16 point lead for UConn. 14 for Walker. He's just about half. Here come the Huskies again. Up by 16. Up by 19 on another three by Kemba Walker. 17 points. Sean Oriaki was at the rim. And he will have Beverly the rebound and the push. Wisely got it. Nice play. Play. Underneath for Combs McDaniel. Oh, is this kid a package? My point guard knew the limitations of his teammates. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Wow. Walker to Oriaki. Nice little screen again. And no panic with Walker. Tough shot, he made it a step back two from just inside the arc. It's a joke. Defended by Brandon Knight. Kentucky's going to need more than threes to get back in it. He's got to play solid. Napier's got to be a little careful with his handle. He's close to a carry. Walker, the left-handed scoop. Point guards out there, isn't it? Two heads. You never have enough. Three is too many. <laughs> Walker, great effort by Giffy to save it. Now they need a shot. And Walker exploded. Darius Miller and Oriaki has his 10th rebound. Walker, look out. He got fouled, wound up crashing into the camera. But the Kentucky's comeback hopes. It's a pretty faint right now, down by 18, and perhaps more than that after Walker shoots. Yeah, I think the biggest seven run. He won't be out for long. I just don't want him to pick up a quick one right away, but he'll be back. Nice double. Walker banged. And Knight with Kemba Walker this summer that trained with the World Championships team that won a gold medal in Turkey. Terrence Jones not up and in. Not up. From Turkey, who has been ruled permanently ineligible by the NCAA because he received. Jeez. How, How about pretty. that? Based on what you've seen so far, you like that prediction? I think Kentucky's probably a little bit better than Florida. They're better than I thought they, they would be without Canner. By the way, 29.6 assists, two rebounds tonight for Kemba Walker, the leader of the Connecticut Huskies, who are 17 seconds away from winning the EA Sports Maui Invitational for the second time. Pretty good. Impressive. And it's a long way from March. And in these non-conference games of this type, you think about resume builders with an eye toward the NCAA tournament. And they have two big notches on their belt. Michigan State and Kentucky defeated on consecutive nights by the Yukon Huskies, the 2010 EA Sports Maui Invitational champs. This team grew up Right before our eyes, led by Kemba Walker and Alex Oriaki, but Walker made everybody better. They came in with a chip, it looked like, Sean. Uh, they were going to prove that they could play together, play effectively, and I'm just so impressed with their defense. Extraordinary. Containing some great guys with the bounce. Jim Calhoun. Congratulations to him. A wonderful coaching job. Oriaki at 18 and 11 for him tonight. 84-67, the final Sports Center next for Jay Billis, Bill Raftery, Sean McDonough saying aloha from Maui and happy Thanksgiving, everybody. The preceding has been an exclusive presentation of ESPN, the worldwide leader in sports.